Hey guys, it's Andy. Um, I'm doing this for uh, Mr. Wong's biology class. Um, um, today I'm gonna be singing a song based off of uh, Mary Had a Little Lamb. Uh, that's gonna be talking about the Calvin cycle. You guys don't know what the Calvin cycle is? That's okay. I'm here to help you. Let's begin. The Calvin cycle is so great. It's so great. It's so great. The Calvin cycle is so great, and now I'll tell you about it. It begins with five RUBP, RUBP, RUBP. It begins with five RUBP, then comes an enzyme Rubisco helping carbon dioxide bond with the RUBP, 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 bond with the uh, RUBP to create an unstable six carbon molecule. It breaks down into six three phosphoglycerates. 3 phosphoglycerates, 3 phosphoglycerates, it breaks down into 6 3 phosphoglycerates, then we put in ATP, which becomes ADP. Then we have 6 1 3 bisphosphoglycerates, 6 1 3 bisphosphoglycerates, 6 1 3 bisphosphoglycerates, then we have 6 1 3 bisphosphoglycerates, then we put in NADPH, which becomes NADPH. Plus. Then we have 6 G3P, 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 then we have 6 G3P. We have G3P, which is known as glyceraldehyde three phosphate. One of those three, one of those G3Ps becomes a sugar, a sugar, a sugar. One of those G3Ps becomes a sugar. The other five move on through the cycle to regenerate RUBP. Yeah, all right. Now the Kelvin cycle split into three sections. Now I'll tell you: one, carbon fixation; two. Reduction. Three. Regeneration of RUBP. Yeah, yeah, you know the Calvin cycle. Made by Melvin Calvin, who went to Berkeley. Yeah, that UC Berkeley. The Calvin cycle is found in the stroma of the chloroplast and is important in what you say? Photosynthesis. One of the most important life processes of the Earth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peace out, guys. Thank you for watching my video.